Are you ready to upgrade to the latest Windows 11 version 24H2? Before you hit that update button, there are some important things you need to know. This update brings exciting new features and enhancements, but it's crucial to ensure your PC is ready for the transition. Now, let's dive in and make sure you're fully prepared for a smooth upgrade experience. First, let's see what's new in 24H2. The most impressive one is the AI integration exclusive to Copilot plus PCs. It offers live captions that support 44 languages, improved Windows Studio effects for better video conferencing experiences, an AI-powered co-creator in Paint, and auto super resolution for enhancing the graphics of your game. In addition to these AI-integrated features, there's also a feature called Recall that can capture snapshots of their activities for easy retrieval of past actions. And it brings enhancements to File Explorer, energy management options, and support for advanced connectivity like Bluetooth LE Audio and Wi-Fi 7. Overall, Windows 1124H2 aims to provide a more intuitive and efficient computing experience. For more details on its new features, you can go to this video or the link to the official site that I put in the description. Now, here's something you should know before updating to 24H2. There comes a system requirement for the device if you want to succeed in upgrading. Only computers that meet the latest OS's hardware specifications are eligible for the update. And there are some changes for different devices, but the primary needs remain constant. You can pause the video here to evaluate whether your system meets the requirements. To check if your device meets the requirement, you can search for Why Not Win AI in Google, go to GitHub, and look for releases on the right side. Scroll down and download this compressed file. After that, unzip it and open the executable file. Then, you'll get a new window. Here, we click on Check Compatibility and wait for a few seconds. The results will tell you which hardware and programs meet the requirements and which ones do not. You can upgrade your device based on its results to ensure it meets the requirements of 24H2. Just in case you didn't know, one of the most important hardware requirements is that the storage device must be an SSD. And to ensure compatibility, you have to make sure that it's a GPT disk and not an MBR one. So what if you already have an SSD full of data, but it's using the MBR partitioning style? Don't worry, EZUS Partition Master can help you convert MBR disks to GPT disks without losing data. First of all, download and open the tool. Go to Disk Converter. Here, we choose MBR to GPT, then select your target disk and click Convert to start. Once your device meets the requirements, you can upgrade it to Windows 1124H2. But before that, I recommend that you back up your system and data to avoid accidental data loss. You can use a tool like EZUS Partition Master to clone the entire disk to an external hard drive, or EZUS To-Do Backup to back up your system and data to the cloud. After that, you can upgrade your system without worries. Some users may encounter various issues during the upgrade process, even if their device is up to snuff. Here are some common error codes. Some of them are caused by missing or corrupted installation files. Some are due to insufficient space on the system partition, and this is where EZUS Partition Master comes into play. It can help you easily resize the partition without losing data. For more details about the 24H2 update error, you can head to the link in the description. That's it then, you've learned everything you need to know. Don't forget to like and follow my channel if you found the video useful. I'll see you next time.